1534 to 1599, the mid to late 16th century. And now let's move on with the flute in the 16th century. We will start in 1533 in Paris. Pierre Etienneau published two collections of 58 songs. They are meant for a four-part consort of recorders or flutes. This is the most notable flute consort music of that time. As we were discussing in the last video, the French flute culture had spread into other European courts. By the mid-16th century, we can conclude these courts had flute consorts, such as the Lyonnais Rafi flutes, to use for military and other ceremonial functions. One other thing we touched on in the last video was about the courts having inventories of hundreds of flutes. It is important to point out court musicians didn't own their own instruments. They were lent out to them. Before the wars of 1562 to 1598, in Lyon, France, the flute and recorder thrived in a rich amateur music scene. Sure, it was home of the popular Rafi flutes, but because of their amateur music scene, trade fairs disseminated not only domestic Lyonnaise music, but also foreign music. By 1559, the consort flute had made it to Venice. We also have one of the names of the first Italian flute makers, Giacomo Bassano. The flute being played in consorts was common by mid-16th century Italy, but also in combinations with other instruments. In 1563, Orlando de Lasso of Bavaria becomes one of the first to use instruments in a church. The Venetian musicians had been working in Munich, where they found the different groupings of instruments. In 1565, Andrea Gabrielli published a motet collection intended for voices or instruments of all kinds. A little late, but even the Pope at the Vatican had two fifers and two drummers among his Swiss guards by the end of the 16th century. In Italy, a new form of music comes into being, the solo sonata, meaning a solo instrument played with harmonic accompaniment improvised from a given bass line. The sonata had spread widely in Italy with the invention of the printing press, and a growing amateur music scene. It soon will spread elsewhere. In the next video, we will cover from here all the way up to the very beginnings of the Baroque flute.